What is up, YouTube? Welcome back to our living room. We are the October. So today we're checking out Hacksaw Ridge. You guys have been telling us for a long time we need to watch it. No spoilers, you guys said. Don't check out anything about it. Apparently, this is a true story. Have you ever seen this movie? No, I haven't, but I do know it came out in 2016. It was directed by Mel Gibson, and if you have a dad born in the 50s, you 100% know who Mel Gibson is. 100%. <laughs> it was at 84% in Rotten Tomatoes. Other than that, I just know it's a true story. So by the way, if you are a veteran watching this, man, thank you so much for your service. It really does mean a lot to us, and I really genuinely hope you enjoy this reaction if you are looking for the full uncut reaction and early join our patreon patreon guys it's only five dollars a month you can get a flash pass we're gonna add another tier eventually guys i know we keep saying it but it's coming we're, we're just waiting to get to 50 and then we'll add another yeah tier. we're almost at 50 and once we hit there i think we're gonna go ahead and add that other tier all right guys hacksaw ridge let's go let's go a true story that's what we like to see this is filmed crazy Man, that'd be the worst way to go right there. I know. The Lord is the everlasting God, and his understanding no one can fathom. But those who hope in the Lord will renew their strength. They will soar on wings like eagles. Hang on! Desmond! Desmond! What? Wait up! Catch up! <laughs> what? How? Where should it be talking? Hey, cheater! Is that you growing up mm -hmm. in the woods? Just not in the mountains, though. Yeah, that's that'd be cool. <laughs> that's yeah, so beautiful. Cool. Their old man's crazy, apparently. <laughs> they dug up the corner of Jackson and Maine, put it in the sidewalk. You boys wouldn't recognize it now. That guy's familiar. It seems like he's a bad guy in a lot of things. Mind you, I doubt they'd recognize you. They hardly know me when I walk by. It's like I died with you. It's like we boys never existed. A lot of graves. Well, that's all I got for you today. Man, so he fought in World War One, I, I guess. Yeah. Maybe I'm wrong. Oh, oh my, my god. god. Tom! Wake up. Can you hear me? What the hell are you doing? Oh my god. Oh, bro. Hell, you hear me? Oh my god. I hope he doesn't die. Man, he did that before he even knew what he was doing. Oh, not the belt. I'm gonna have to beat you now. You hear me, Dad? Yes, man! Tom, stop. What's that gonna teach the boy? He's violent enough already. Okay, fine. You go smother him and kiss him. Hell's gonna be okay. She's very optimistic. They're a lot calmer than I would be right now. I know. I could have killed him. Yes, you could have. Murder, it's the worst sin of all. And to take another man's life, that is the most egregious sin in the Lord's side. Don't sleep at all. I hate him. Mama, why does he hate us so? Oh, he don't hate us. He hates himself. Your daddy denied that ain't the real him. I wish you knew him like I did before the war. Mm -hmm. I mean, that would change you forever. Especially one as brutal as that one. Yeah. Car fell on him, changing the oil. Oh! Mm. I'll phone an ambulance. Oh, no time. Joshua, pick up. Oh, God. Good job, a turning kit. You're gonna be fine now. You're gonna be fine. What do you got here? It's a severed artery. Get some sutures? Yes, doctor. Put some pressure on it. Should you apply this tourniquet? Yes, sir. Nice work. You might have saved this boy's life. You staying with us? You're gonna be okay. You don't think you realized it until he told him? But you don't think you like realized the magnitude of what he might have just did? Yeah, I mean, no, because a lot of people don't think like you need to save that artery. Like they, a lot of people don't think that. He's very smart. You look taken back by that. Army physicals that way. This is for giving blood. Are you all right? You better say something that's coming. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for asking, though, Mel. What do you need? My belt. You said your Melon address? <laughs> well, uh, I don't have your belt. No, I know that ma'am is out there. It's right out there with the boy still. <laughs> I'm just here to take blood. I'll give you mine. Okay. I go to that room over there and wait with the others. I'll call you. Ah! <laughs> uh, what? You ever given blood before, Mr. Doss? But my friends call me Desmond. No, man, my first time. You watch all those people die in the open scene, no problem. A little needle. <laughs> You're like... Maybe a little 
dizzy when we're done. Somebody picking you up? No, ma'am. Walking back. Where do you live? Fort Hill, ma'am. That's a ways. Oh. Just five or six miles. I cut through the woods. You must really like the woods. Yes, ma'am. Sure do. Where are you going looking all spruced and nice? Met someone yesterday. Nurse over at the hospital. Her name's Dorothy Shooty. I'm gonna marry her. <laughs> Have you ever even spoken to a woman? I mean, one that's not family? Spoke to her. Oh, in that case, come give your brother a big hug. Hell, I'm here. Keep your greasy paws off of me. Wish me luck, mama. Good luck. <gasps> you ever given blood before? Yes, ma'am, I have. You're the belt man. Yes, yes ma'am. I thought they've known each other at this point. <laughs> Time to get mine back. You what? My blood, I need it back. <laughs> well, it don't work like that. We can't just give it back to you. Well, you got to. Ever since you stubbed me with that needle, my heart's been beating real fast. Every time I think about you, it beats faster still. <gasps> I never heard that one before. It's pretty corny. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's a shame. I, I don't practice that all night. Yeah, he was not smooth. <laughs> mm -hmm. It worked, though. Yeah, she's there, right? Don't even think about it, bro. <laughs> Just chill. <laughs> you might bite her or something. Yeah, he's ahead right now. Between an artery and a vein. What are you talking about? Arteries spur blood. And veins? Please. I think you need to practice your boy-girl date and talk at home before you come out. <laughs> <laughs> I'll give you a book if you're that interested. On dating? On blood. <laughs> They're both corny. Yeah. Oh! Maybe he wasn't sure how to approach that. Yeah. Oh my god. I'm sorry, I didn't think you'd mind. You didn't ask. <laughs> Thought you might have liked it. Well, I might have if you'd asked. <laughs> You coming? <laughs> <laughs> They're confusing. <laughs> they don't like that. Why didn't you say nothing to us? Oh, that he enlisted? I was protecting loads of boys from our church are going. There's a war, and they need men. Working in a paper mill ain't gonna save this country. It looks like a movie star. Our boy. Nice uniform. Good hat. Reminds me of how Artie Gittins looked in his uniform when we went to France. Remember him, Bertha? Don't die. What? Mm. I just hope that when our Hal gets shot, it's through the front of his jacket. Like a simple entry wound. Not much mess. Artie got hit in the back. It blew most of his guts and intestines out his front. Awful everywhere. Wrecked his uniform entirely. It was lucky he was dead, so he never knew how awful his uniform looked. Wow. That was crazy. Get out of my sight. Those two are so colorful and like the rest of everything isn't. Are you gonna help me, Desmond Dawes? I help you, but it's gonna cost you. What? A kiss. That is pure blackmail. Well, yes, ma'am, it is, but that is still my condition. <laughs> Sounds like us the other day. Oh, hold on now. You ain't gonna slap me, are you? Till I fall off, I'm gonna take you with me. Kiss me and find out. I hope nothing bad happens to them. Oh my gosh. Yeah, the spot we went to didn't look like that. Oh no, not at all. <laughs> I have to enlist. Oh wow. I can't stay here while all them go fight for me. I won't be a medic. I figure I'll be saving people, not killing them. I have to go to work. I'm gonna be late. Dorothy, Dorothy. So are you gonna ask me to marry you or what? <gasps> I don't know. You still gonna have me? Well, I wouldn't know. You haven't asked. <laughs> well, I'm asking you. Are you marry me? Then yes. Yes, I will. <laughs> when? <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, I love you. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like that's the happiest scene in this movie so far. Yeah. And they're only gonna get worse. I hope not. Mama said come see you here. He's about to tell him don't go. Oh god. These three were my best friends. I grew up. I got into trouble with them. 18 years school. old. Listed with them. Now my friends are there, covered in dirt and grass and eaten by worms. I don't want to have to visit my sons here. Mm. Daddy, I, I signed up already. I couldn't do otherwise, Pop. Everybody else is, is doing it. Ain't everybody else. Everybody else jumps in, does things quick without thinking like the damn idiot fools we were. You know, and soldiers who live, they live because they can do that. You can't. You got to sit and think and pray about everything. <laughs> you won't be able to live with yourself if you go. No, I won't be able to live with myself if I don't. I'm going to be a medic. That's going to be my way to serve. See, there you go, thinking it all out. But you figure this war is just going to fit in with you? Your ideas? Well, I know. I don't doubt it's going to be hard. It won't be hard. It'll be impossible. You know, whatever beliefs you have and your crazy head now, they won't ever play out. It don't work that way. And if by some, I don't know, miracle chance you survive, you won't be giving no thanks to God. That poor man, I everyone know. he knows in his life is going to die in a war. Oh, my God. Here, I want you to have this. I love you. That's so hard for her. Poor thing. Or Jackson. Hey, sorry, pal. What in the world? You okay there? Look lost. Randall Fuller. Desmond Dolph. Call him teach. No one understands a word he says. That's because no one else here can read. 
The testicles there belong to a man calling himself Hollywood. Vince Vaughn? <laughs> you are a very strange looking individual, if you don't mind me saying so. <laughs> <laughs> Andy Walker. How long have you been dead, son? <laughs> <laughs> I am not, sir! I am Sergeant Howell or Sir! The name is Ghoul, you say? Walker. <laughs> Sergeant. Ghoul. <laughs> it is. Just Sergeant. He's mean. <laughs> He's gonna kill him. <laughs> There's something off in your presentation. <laughs> is it your hair? Is it the wrinkle in your trousers? I have a knife in my foot, Sergeant. <laughs> That's it, the knife. Hey, you're Indian war cry, son! <laughs> Are you a garter snake? No, Sergeant! Are you a chipmunk? No, Sergeant! Are you contradicting me, private? No, Sergeant! Good. Then I shall henceforth call you chief as a sign of great respect to your people. <laughs> Thank you, Sergeant! <laughs> what is this movie? Name private. Desmond Dahl. I have seen stocks of corn with better physiques. <laughs> Carry your weight. Yes, Sergeant. Should be easy for you then. Corporal, let's make sure you keep this man away from strong winds. Yeah. <laughs> Private idiot. Yes, Sergeant. Raise your foot. Higher. <laughs> he didn't even say anything to that guy. No. I said move it. All right, just get him a uniform, Sergeant. Should I ask him too, Corporal? No memory of it, Sergeant. Just let him put it on, please. <laughs> I'm gonna teach you how to tie a bowline knot so you can get your sorry asses down from a height. So I may then kick them. The rabbit comes out of his hole, runs around the tree, goes back into the hole. <laughs> All right, go. Very good, Tex. Keep struggling, Teach. Have you ever roped a goat, Hollywood? No, Sarge. Have you ever looked into a goat's eyes? No, Sarge. Good, that would be unnatural. <laughs> <laughs> You know if you don't breathe, you'll die. You just fell 50 feet and broke your neck. Private Vito Vanelli. You strangled yourself, numb nuts. If you're American, you'd be taller. <laughs> what do we got here, Doss? One for each titty. <laughs> Not building a bra. What is so funny, Corporal? Couldn't tell you, Sergeant. <laughs> but I want to see some fire here! A little hustle! Show me something! Run like you need it! Down, down, down! Private, come on, come on. Come on. Go with that time, boys! It's oh, God. Hustle! Move! Dang, for what? What did he do? I mean, he did just have a knife in his I know, so like, like a... It's a personal gift from the United States government to each and every one of you. Standard issue U.S. rifle. This is to be your lover, your mistress, your concubine. Perhaps the only thing in life you'll ever truly love. Fellas, let's dance. Have a girl. Don't point your gun forward. I do not want to be shot today. Place the weapon by your side. Okay. Pay attention. Where's his? Problem, Private Cornstalk. No dog. I was told I don't have to carry a weapon. Come again. Step forward, Private. I can't be here in this right. <laughs> well, I'm sorry, Sergeant. I can't touch a gun. What exactly is the problem? No problem. It's just a mistake. It's, uh, I told the Army when I, when I joined up. It's not up. possible. Do you know why it's not possible, Private? No, sir. Because the United States Army does not make mistakes. <laughs> you must be that problem. <laughs> I was just never supposed to be sent to a rifle company. I'm a conscientious cooperator. You screwing with me, Doss? No, <laughs> no, sir. I ain't got no no problem with wearing my uniform, saluting the flag, and, and doing my duty. It's just carrying a gun and taking a human life. She don't kill, that's all. Quite a bit of killing does occur in a war. Do <laughs> you have any other requirements of the United States Army? <laughs> I'm a Seventh-day Adventist, so... Poses a problem to you, Sergeant? We should simply ask the enemy not to invade on the Sabbath, because Private Doss here is a prayer. <laughs> As long as you're in this company, under my command, you will obey my orders. If you can't do it here, I can't trust you to do it in battle. I'm putting you in for a Section 8 psychiatric discharge. Dismissed. Gentlemen, I want you to meet Private Desmond Doss. Private Doss does not believe in violence. He will not even deign to touch a weapon. Do not look to him to save you on the battlefield. <laughs> because he will be too busy wrestling with his conscience to assist. Sarge, that's not true, Private, Sarge. As you were. Now, I realize some of you might have strong feelings about this. It is what we men fight for, to defend our right, to protect our women and children. Even if Private Doss's belief might cause women and children to die. So I will expect everyone in this company to give Private Doss the full measure of respect he is due. Am I clear? Yes, yes Sergeant! Was he looking saying be mean to him? Yeah, he doesn't have any respect for him. What you got here, Desi? You know what that is? It just seems kind of small. It's half the Bible for half the man. For sake, sakes, Smitty, give him back his Bible. I don't remember speaking to you. Thanks. 
So how come you don't fight? You think you're better than us? No. But what if you was attacked? Oh. <laughs> uh-uh. <laughs> uh-uh, boy. <clears throat> they don't know he, he, he used a brick back in the day. I think this is cowardice. Plain and simple. Well, go on. Take a poke. Tell you what, I'm going to give you a free shot. Right Why? Well, take it. Go on. No? He doesn't want to. What is this? Give me that. This is a fine looking brawl. Right. Give me that back. Please. Please. Please give it back, Smitty. Please give it back, Smitty. He gave it back. Rude. You hear voices, Desmond? Sir, I'm not a crazy person. Is that how you feel most people regard you, a, a crazy person? I'm, I'm different. I know that. I am what I am. It sounds lonely. So you don't. Well, I'm really happy that he doesn't want to bear arms, but I'm glad a lot of people did. Yeah. Because we'd have lost that damn war if everybody had his attitude. Gosh, your area is a disgrace. Oh, he's pissed. I'm funny, Riker. No sword. You got some shit on your mind. <laughs> Unit is no better than its weakest member. Right now, everybody in full gear for a 20 mile hike. They're gonna try to get him to get out by like punishing him. Don't He's trying to make everyone hate him. Yourself. We're gonna keep going till I drop. It's kind of funny to imagine that Vince Vaughn could go on a 20 mile run. <laughs> and be no yelling shot. at him the whole time like. There they go, look. Oh no. Hey, knock, knock it off. Try to sleep in. Get off me. Okay, get off. Aww. Why the hell are you still here? This isn't good for anybody. Sure ain't what I joined up for. It's not about what you joined up for. It's about the lives of every man in here. Finish getting dressed and I'll walk you down. I'm expecting that speech. That, no, Sergeant. I got extra guard duty today and I'm on KP this morning, so can't. <laughs> there you go. There it was. All right, Doss. Baba Doss, can you identify the men that beat you? No, Sarge. Are you saying that you don't know who attacked? I never said I was attacked, Sarge. Well, what the hell are you saying, Doss? <laughs> you bruised half your body sleeping. I, I sleep pretty hard. <laughs> oh boy, don't snitch. <laughs> hey, Private Dobbs, I'm afraid I can't authorize your pet. How to handle a rifle. And I'll sign here for a while. Hand Private Dobbs your firearm. I won't touch a rifle, sir. I'm not asking you, Private! That is a direct order from the company commander! For God's sake, Dawes, you stop this nonsense and quit. Refuse, and I will have no recourse but to court-martial you. And you will spend the duration of the war in a military prison. Yeah, that's tough, man. Oh, no, God. Oh, no. How much longer would you like to wait, Dorothy? I think it's been long enough. I'm so very sorry. Sometimes men just get cold feet. They'd rather lock that man up than just go let him serve, man. <laughs> You probably think I'm a real son of a bitch He cares only about regulations and not his men I wrestle with my conscience But what do you do when everything you value in this world is under attack? Yeah, fair enough I feel like my values are under attack And I don't know why I'm prepared to give my life for my men You don't win wars by giving up your life Let the brave men out there go and win this war They're tough on him If I can't convince you, maybe she can They wouldn't let me call you I knew it wasn't your making. They're saying you could go to prison. I've done everything they asked me except this one thing. Who are you gonna save in prison? Probably nobody. And why can't you just pick up the stupid gun and wave it around? I don't know, I kinda agree with her. Just wave it around. Never be the man that I wanna be in your eyes. I will love you no matter what. That's scary for her, man. He loses no matter what. We want him to plead guilty, but then he'll get a dishonorable discharge. Otherwise, he fights him and he for sure goes to prison. Either way, he'll call him a coward, and I don't see how he can live with that. Oh, thank you, Dorothy. Tell him that we love him and that we're praying for him. We're praying for both of you. I will. Bye bye. May I help you, sir? I wish to speak to Brigadier General Musgrove. Not without an appointment, you can't. That would be quite impossible. I fought with him in France at Bellow Wood. He was my captain. It's, it's most vital. Amen. Dang, he put on the uniform to come out. And he insisted three times. He couldn't deny me for that. This is a hearing into the matter of private target. Yes, sir, but I changed my mind. Well, on your head then, private. Proceed. Your Honor, Private Doss waves his morality at us like it's some kind of badge of honor. You okay? You're still deliberating? Yes, sir. Okay, now you go take this in. I can't. Strictly military personnel. Well, then you get one of them to take it they in. They ain't out to help. They're fixing to bury him. There is only one question that any military court need to ask of the accused. Oh, he's about to walk in, ain't he? Mm-hmm. And it's probably gonna be crazy. Why are you contesting it, then? Why is it so important to you, given your refusal to even touch a weapon, to serve in a combat unit? Because when the Japanese attacked Pearl Harbor, 
I took it personal. Everyone I knew was on fire to join up, including me. There were two men in my hometown. They killed themselves because they couldn't serve. It isn't right that other men should fight and die, that I would just be sitting at home safe. I need to serve, to serve as a medic. While everybody else is taking life, I'm gonna be saving it. Sorry, sir. Nobody's allowed to No, you don't understand. My son is the defense. While the sentiments expressed are laudable, the facts of the charge seem incontestable, so... I didn't go. That's a great war uniform. It is, sir. sir. I need to show you this. With respect, sir, you are no longer a member of the military. Is that truly the way it works? You fight for your country, you lose so much that was dear to you, and then you're done with it? You were at least. I was, sir, Annabella Wood. Twice decorated, I see. Yes, sir. I take it you are... Check them. Thank you, Corporal Dust. Let me have the letter. You must go. You know, like, hate him, but you like him, you know? He's just been through it. The defendant's rights as a conscientious objector are protected by an act of Congress, and he can... That includes, in this case, He's disobeying orders to bear arms. Signed, Brigadier General Musgrove, War Services Commander, Washington, D.C. Well, I withdraw the charges, sir. Then this case is dismissed. Private Doss, you are free to run into the hellfire of battle without a single weapon to protect yourself. You may resume your duties and begin training as a combat medic. <gasps> well, where is he? Gone, straight after. I begged him to stay out. When you get home, you tell him I love him. Okay. Okinawa, May 45. Mm. They know they ain't about to be the same. 96. What's left of them? These are the guys we're replacing. Oh, God. Oh, my goodness. That's gracious. what they were looking at them like. Like, y'all just have no idea. Mm -hmm. And they were just throwing them out by the trucks. All clear, sir! Captain Glover. Lieutenant Manville, 96. We've been assigned to you, sir. Okay, let's get these men some jail. This is, uh, Sergeant Hal. You, Doss? Herb Schechter. You and me and Paige here. It's about the only medics we got left in this area, so I guess we're gonna be working together. You just come off the line. What's it like? Hacksaw. We climbed up six times. Six times they threw us off. Last time there wasn't anything left of the 96. Stinking animals. And they ain't never gonna give up. They just look defeated, kinda. Lose all your Red Cross markings. Nips put a premium on shooting medics. Oh wow, I'll take it off. Here, I got you a new helmet. So I wonder how many they would run if there's only three now. That's our objective. Get Okinawa, take Japan. Take a breather. Our pals in the Navy are gonna soften them up for us. Honestly, I like this scene. Yeah. Damn, they gotta go up there. Imagine like climbing up that, like just the, what you feel in your stomach. That poor guy has to go back out already. It's all different up there. And you don't even know if they're like right there. Look at the blood dripping. Oh my God. What? No shit. You think it's just pouring down the hill? We're not in Kansas anymore, Dorothy. This evolved fast, like they're already here. So this could be pivotal for the war if they take this ridge. So the only way they were able to get up that ridge is because the Navy was keeping that spot clear? <gasps> oh my God. <gasps> oh my God. Where the fuck? Oh my God. Put your hand on there, Jack. Come on, Come on we, we, we gonna get you undercover, Jack. Oh my, oh my god, dude. <laughs> like, don't get me wrong, that was smart, but like, oh my god. I can't see anything! Is that one? I don't know, just shoot! Get up! Get up! Oh no. <sighs> oh my god. Okay, I'm here. You think he's gonna save him? I hope so. Get out of the way! Oh my gosh, that was Desmond. You hurt? I'm fine. You can see his legs I shoot know, off. Did that's you see what... that? <gasps> Oh my god, that hurts my insides. You know, most people wouldn't even stop what they're doing to try to help him. Because it's like, you know, that just yeah. looks like a hopeless situation. Because you move on to something different. What's man. he gonna do for you in war, you know? I'm gonna shot him off for you to move on. Yeah. For the triage, he'll be dead before we get him down. You don't know that! Get him down! Hey! Okay, it's all right, buddy. We're gonna get you home. Help! I got you, Frank! Right here! <gasps> I think they can see it, it. Come on, come on! Get down, sir! Over there! The bunker! I still better stay down, sir! You bad tight? You're gonna be right as right. Got him, Toss. Got him. How many is that? Four or five? I'm not sure. Well, they blew that thing up, didn't they? Fire! Son of a bitch! No, 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 don't go there. You! Get on it! Yes, sir! Get on fire! Because you really can't be fighting for survival right there. You can't hang on to life right here. I mean, you just you just have to accept that you're dead. I mean, that's the only thing you can do, right? Ah. Satchel! 
But I'm saying when you accept that you're dead, that just means that you, you know what I'm saying? You just don't have fear. You can't. Right. Stick it cool. Is that a C4? Son of a bitch. They're advancing on the position though. Mm -hmm. A little. Cover his ass! Oh boy, you're right there. You better get down. And that's ghoul right there. He's dead. Gosh, look how close he is. Oh my gosh. He's brave. Oh my goodness. Nice, nice, nice. That was a good move right there. They advanced. Some of these boys got a good shot though. They can take out a whole line at once. I've seen it. Put your hand on it. <gasps> oh, he threw him on top of it. Mm. That was the um. That was crazy. Oh my god, that was the captain. Did they really have flamethrowers? Mm hmm Did they really? Mm-hmm. I think that was like World War II, like, I, I hate to say this because of Call of Duty, but like that, you know how like they showcase like World War II weapons? That was like a thing. Really? Yeah. You got a bump on the head, that's okay. Okay, what's your name? Andy. Andy what? Andy Walker. And also known as? <laughs> cool. Cool. <laughs> cool, you're okay, you're okay. That poor guy, man. Good work. Dig in for the night. We hold this spot. We mop up the rest of the ridge tomorrow. Okay, boys. Find yourself a nice safe hole in or near the bunker. Rotate watch every two hours. We don't know what's out there. Heads down, asses lower. Shoot anything that don't speak English. <laughs> it ain't safe to go out there alone. Where the hell you going, Doc? Feel more wounded out there, Sarge. I'll go with him. Be smart. Keep your ears down. I don't know if they're going to be best buddies. <sighs> Did you know that, Mumu? I didn't think that. But you said, yeah. <laughs> don't be best buddies. Brunelli and Henry dead in the first 15 minutes. Just straight off. Peterson, Popeye, Stanford, and Murphy. Page and Hunger, Ralston. In peace, sons bury their father. In war, fathers bury their sons. Dang. You wanna stop spouting that crap up and don't help none? Yeah, you got that right. Right here. Hey, we got an abdominal wound. Ned's gonna need some plasma. You got it. Leave him with us. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Man. They got you. Desmond's pretty brave out there now. Should we find a home to dig in? Not good to me. Well, so is that guy. You ain't gonna eat them. I don't eat meat. Have yourself. Of course you don't. <laughs> <laughs> That's one heck of a dame. You know you're fighting out of your weight class with her, don't you? Yes, I do. I'm an asshole sometimes. Sometimes? Yeah, all right. I'm glad they're getting to smile right now, though. Oh, my God. Some of these scenes, I don't even know what to say. I know. It's just, like, tough. How can you sleep, you know? Like, I would, I know you'd have to, but that'd be tough. Yeah, it'd probably be hard. First 30 hours, maybe. And then you'd just be exhausted. <laughs> oh, it's a dream. It has to be. I love a dream. Dream to God, myself. Rifle's just hit. It won't bite. Yeah, it will. <laughs> My daddy's a drunk. He fought it for years, but it kind of got a hold of him hard and made him mean. At least you knew it. Mine could have been any one of ten guys, and none of them were worth a damn, so. So your mama raised you? I knew her, but she gave me to an orphanage when I was five. Never saw her again. I learned how to hate quick. <laughs> learned how to judge people quicker, and I got you very wrong. That's enough! No more! No! Do you hear me? Pull that damn trigger! Stop it! Stop! But you didn't kill him. In my heart, I did. <laughs> so that's when I made my promise to God I ain't never gonna touch a gun again. Well, I ain't giving you mine because you're crazy. <laughs> oh no, I don't want to be on their side. <laughs> they just are running at them. No fear. That's crazy, man. Oh, oh, get your asses over here! Yeah, when I saw the knife at the end, I knew they were like some close combat people. What's that called? A bayonet or something? No idea. Oh, man! Oh my god. Get out of here, kid! Oh no. Keep pressure on it! No, don't need plasma. Give it to him! Over there! I'll be okay. Go, go. Race! We're back! It's a good man. See you soon! Well, he's the other medic, right? We gotta move right now. Come on! Yeah. Oh my god. Crazy as hell. There is way too many bodies right there. His buddy. Oh, he's gonna save him though. I don't know. He got shot in the chest or something. Oh, the Navy pulled up. I'm scared. I'm scared. Go help the paint. No, would you do that? Come on. Come on, Smitty. You stay with me. Let's go. We gotta move. Hey, yeah, help me get him down. Help me get him down. Yeah. You think you ever would have thought? That guy would be helping him out like this when he mm -mm. was slapping him up. Nope. Was he dead? Off the ridge! And they failed to take the ridge, man. Oh my god. He was so close to making it too, y'all. What is it you want of me? I don't understand. I can't hear you. Help me! 
All right. Don't you feel like that's a smoke monster? No. <laughs> what? It's like I'm lost. Like, you know, oh it's like someone God. setting him up. Gosh, I got to edit that out for real. <laughs> Maybe I love you. You're so funny. <laughs> Mine. Where the forward? How many? 32 only came down, sir. Oh, my God. Harry. Here's Desmond. We, we all fix you up. You just got to keep breathing. Colonel wants to see you, sir. Stay here. Keep watch. Keep your eyes peeled for Japs. No, but stay here. Keep watch. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. He didn't want to hear the message. He just wrote off. Help me. I got you. Get your hand on. Keep pressure on. I'm coming back. Okay? We pray all together. We're at the end, Jerry. How's he going to get him down from there? Perry, you're okay, buddy. Son of a gun. This is going to work. Go up for each leg, Eric. We gonna get you dressed up in a jiffy and get oh you. Oh my god, water. you know how he at the beginning he said one for each. Yeah. It worked. Trust me now, Eric. Trust me. Dad! Hold on, one of ours, hold on! That'd have been terrible if you would have shot him. I know, after all that hard work they did to get him right there, that's tough. You're okay. You're okay. <gasps> oh god. He's breathing. Another one! Colonel, call off the artillery attack on Axel. I couldn't call it in. There's still over a hundred men left up there. Tell him to call off the artillery on Hacksaw. Sit down, Jack. I'll get you a drink. <gasps> They're stirring. We got move. Come on. They just keep coming, brother. Oh, my God. They're... <gasps> oh. So they're just stabbing everything? Killing anything that breathes. <gasps> you don't have to trust me. Take a breath. No shot. You know how hard it would be not to cough right now? Oh, my God. I definitely would. Or I'd go... <laughs> Oh my gosh. Oh my god, that's like a good place to throw a grenade. We forgot. Oh, I knew it. Isn't that their dang quarters and he's up in there? Oh my god. Oh, he hung himself. Oh my god. Oh no. Oh my he's gonna god. be telling people about this. Ain't nobody gonna believe him. <gasps> oh my gosh. Morphine. Oh my gosh. Would you do that? Mm, I don't know, man. I like to think I would. Me too. But I don't know. He was in there. You know what I'm saying? It's one thing if you're just out in the field and there's no one around, but he was in there for real, so. It's Dawes. It's Dawes. Be quiet. Yeah. I got you. Are you in it? Yeah. I can't see. Be quiet. Just be quiet. Hold tight. Try now. Try now. I thought it was blind. You keep it down. Can you walk? He said, I don't know. I hope you don't get shot. I just have a feeling one of these people that he's saving are not going to make it. Yeah, In I a know. really dramatic way. Or him. Hey, Ted. It's me. It's Desmond. I'm going to fix you up. Are you ready to get out of here? I sure am. Oh, my God. He made it a long time out there. Please, Lord. Help me get one more. His hands. Help me get one more. One more. Help me get one more. One more. So I'm guessing that he's probably gonna pass out on this hill eventually. I don't know. He's the internet all he has. It looks and like. somebody's gonna have to realize that the bodies aren't coming down no more, and they're gonna have to go get him. I thought they pulled out. Not all of them. Some nuts up there dragging wounded from the top. Even lowered a couple of Japs. <laughs> they didn't make it. I'm back with you directly. They didn't make it. Do you think they killed him? It's tough. No. I mean, it's still war. What are they gonna do? Help him, and they're gonna be on our side all of a sudden? Yeah, I know, right? It's just tough. They seem pretty defeated, though. <laughs> Dang, he's still up there? Son of a bitch. Private corn stock. You want some morphine? Hell yes. Better or both. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Let me see. How's this? Oh, I thought he was dead. It looks much worse than it is. And girls will still won't kiss you. <laughs> Sarge, you okay here for a while? Yeah, fine. Get out of here. I'm coming back. You ready? Let's go. Man, I hope the sergeant makes it. <laughs> I hope they all do like <laughs> I like the sergeant. I liked him ever since he was yelling at everybody. He was he yelling. He made this like, he brought comic relief to this. <laughs> he was yelling like he was just a damn good guy. <laughs> Captain, something you gotta see. Our guys have been coming down in droves all night. Hollywood's here. I never thought I'd see that guy again. Come on, follow me. He's right here. What the hell is this? How you doing, sir? Hey, cat. Why is he just now figuring out about this? You've been asleep. Number. House up there. What hell and Doss did this? No, it's just Doss. Just Doss. Doss the coward. I don't think he should move. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh no. Nice. Nice shot. You're like I'm on a shoe, ain't you? Give me this. It's a bit late for target practice now, don't you think? Jump on it. You're kidding. I'm gonna drag you. <laughs> Let's do it. Let's go. <laughs> wow. Oh, they see him? Oh my god. <laughs> I bet he never thought he would be in that moment. Uh-uh. You gotta be kidding me, Cornstone. You're trying to bowline, boy, not building a brush. <laughs> Please, no. Oh, my God. Okay. 
Oh, he didn't even wrap around the stump. You just gotta go. Oh my god. Hmm. At least he's alive, though. Mm hmm. But that hurt, and you know it. Put me down! Yes, Sergeant. Sergeant now. Oh. Doss is still up there. He's got chaps on his tail. Oh, hell no. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, y'all are crazy. They probably looked over that thing and got. <laughs> they were not ready. Hey, it's okay, Doc. Oh, it's, it's alright. Are you wounded? Mm. No. Let's get this soldier to a hospital tent right now. Yeah, he earned that rest, boy. They need to go clean <coughs> his hands up. <clears throat> that was tough. Look at all those families that don't have to grieve. Thanks to him. Give me a check to their medic. He didn't make it. Or at shot. least not. No plasma. Sorry. Wow. All I saw was a skinny kid. I didn't know who you were. You've done more than any other man could have done in the service of his country. Now I've never been more wrong about someone in my life. I hope one day you can forgive me. The character development in true stories. We have to go back up tomorrow. Unbelievable, man. What the heck? Most of these men don't believe the same way you do. But they believe so much in how much you believe. And what you did on that ridge, just nothing short of a miracle. And they're not gonna go up there without you. What the hell is your delay, Captain? You were supposed to begin that assault ten minutes ago. We're waiting, sir. Waiting for what? Private Doss to finish praying for us, sir. Private Doss is praying for you. Who the hell is Private Doss? Oh my gosh. Let's go to work. They have to do it all again. That's what I'm saying. I'm not really prepared for all this. I thought he was off the ridge, man. It's making my stomach turn thinking about them going up there again. I don't think some of them are going to be this lucky this time. How do you man. believe that, though, you know? Like, I feel like you can't believe that when someone puts the flag up. I feel like they're going to plan, like, an assault. This scares me, dude. Look at him. <laughs> Oh. I got some more feet. Scars, get this man out of here. There goes that scene in the opening. Stop. Yeah, like the very opening scene, right? Okay. Oh my god, please don't die getting that thing. Yeah, they're stabbing themselves in the stomach. But who are those guys, like the, the military leaders? Yeah, probably so. Because see, in their minds, they don't want to die at the hands of the Americans. They'd rather take their own lives. <gasps> oh my god. You going home, Desmond. We've taken an axe off. Desmond! Whoa, there's more than just <clears throat> one man doing it. Yeah. That is a crazy shot right there. He's at peace. Could you imagine feeling at peace up there? With your leg half blown off? Wow. Oh, that's him. Wow. Mm. One year before I was born. Me too. I was praying the whole time. I was just kept praying, Lord, please help me get one more. When I got this, I say, Lord, please help me get one more. Wow, he's so humble. When you're under conviction, that is not a joke. That's what you are. He was one of the... <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, that light's bright. <clears throat> <laughs> For real. <laughs> what the heck, oh, Mel Gibson? Man, my eyes tired. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you ready to go to bed. It was a little movie. Oh, dude, I had it together the whole movie until the real person came on. Oh, so I'm edit so I edited tears in your eyes. Uh, Is that what you're gonna say? And the words. You're getting good. It must <laughs> oh, be that yeah. chat GPT four. Oh, uh, maybe. All right, guys, so that was Hacksaw Ridge. This movie was, honestly, it was incredible. Uh, first time I've shed a tear on this channel. I held it together the whole time until the very end, man. Until, Are you for real, dude? It was sad, you man. You cried up, dude. It was the most, did I really? Yes, No, you I did. didn't, yes. how? Yes, you did. Anyways, guys, so this movie was really good, man. The thing that really got me in the end was when the real person came in. You know, the thing is, guys, is they do everything in a the movie. They give you the camera angles, the cuts, the music, the suspense. They do everything they can possibly do to try to invoke emotion to put you in that place. A movie can come nowhere near to emulating what war would be like, how stressful it would be, how brave you would have to be to be there. So when we react to movies like this, to be honest, there's not really much that I have to say other than I thought the movie was incredible. It was an incredible story, even more amazing that it was real life. But movies like this are to the veterans, man. This is dedicated to you guys. If you're a veteran out there and you've served the country, this one's for you guys. I don't have anything worth adding, to be honest. I hope you guys enjoyed the movie. Did you like the movie, baby? I really like the movie. Um, I really don't want to say much because like, I feel like if I say how I feel, I'm going to just get really emotional and start crying. But um, that guy, oh. Desmond, 
Jalen Dawes is really inspiring. And um, I think, like, him holding his ground and him not, like, you know, just giving into what everyone says just because, like, it might have felt like the right thing to do. He didn't do that and, like, saved so many people and was honestly one of the most brave people. So I think the thing to me that stands out is I think it's beautiful that um, he could live by his own conscious you know I'm oh, sorry I guess at the end of the day like that's what's most important is he was able to live by his own conscious I mean war is not something we can all be pacifist in but at the end of the day you know he had a conviction thank god we live in a country where you can stand by yours so I don't have anything else to add guys just like subscribe come join the team uh that stuff really does help man if you share the videos and drop comments just things like that if you want to get more access to our content and support the work man come hit us up on patreon you can get a flash pass like we said in the intro guys it's only five dollars so we record these things and this thing will be out in the morning so yeah man we're gonna see you guys on the next one this movie was awesome thank you guys so much for recommending it i had a lot of fun watching this with you guys man for real so Me too. i'll see you on a lot the next of tears. one this was good we'll see you on the next one try to top that <laughs> let's go <laughs>